Okay, Monday, uh, November 18th, back at the Hall of <coughs> Justice to follow up with legal, you know, to continue to document the farce, the inhumanity, the inappropriate response, the lack of accountability, the lack of transparency, the lack of a fix, the lack of a correction. Uh, and let's not forget, this was for an immediate disclosure request under Sunshine, the California Public Records Act, you know, for a copy of either the videos or naturally the policies regarding the San Francisco Police Department and its video retention, et cetera, et cetera. And if you've looked at the prior videos, you've noticed where I've posted what I was sent and what my response has been and naturally, you know, the rigged methodology that I've had to endure and I still have not received what was requested to prove on video that I was illegally 5150 at Northern Station. You know, we're now approaching, hmm, Let's see, almost two months? We'll just continue. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm here for Marine Coffrey, please. Yeah, let me speak to my sergeant. Oh, that's more than adequate. So, as I've said before, you know, I still not received the policies. Uh, I was not handled in good faith. You know, et cetera, et cetera. So that's where we're going from here. And, you know, following up. I mean, transparency, accountability, at legal, no less. So, uh, then isn't there anyone else who's available? I'm sorry, why is he the only one that's available to speak to me today? And there's no one above him. They're not here. And how much longer will this delay be? It's not a delay. He's working right now. When he gets back, he will call you. He will call me? And, and this is going to be for what? Another 10 minutes, 20 minutes, an hour? He's working right now. Well, then, I, that's unacceptable. I'd like an ETA. I can't give you an ETA. Mm. He's doing his job right now. He's not sitting in his office, so you can come in. Uh, but you're welcome to wait as long as you want. Yes, and when he doesn't show up after 30 minutes, I'm still able to wait as long as I want, right? For a rig process, it's not going to work. Is that it? It's okay. I mean, I'll continue to videotape the farce. I have no problem with it. It's not I who am, you know, doing something wrong. I'm not the failure. I continue to follow up. I've still been continued to treat, been treated incorrectly, inhumanely. Mind you, this was, like I said, for an IDR under sunshine. You know, this happened in September. It's now November. Laws, humanity, civility, quick follow-up, correct process. It depends, I guess, in which world you're living in. You know, because it certainly doesn't exist in this world. So, you know, I'm not told when he'll be showing up, or even if he will be showing up, just that he's busy right now. You know, it, it, it's a wonderful game of illusion, you know, and then if I leave in 10 or 15 minutes, you know, it's his fault he left because it was truly because, you know, he was expecting civility and just didn't get it. Oh, oh, oh. Blame the victim, the usual, you know, but that's quite all right. This is going on YouTube to continue to show not only the continual farce, but the inhumanity with impunity that's dispensed by San Francisco's finest. You know, accountability, transparency. Mm. I'm the one who did everything correctly and requested everything correctly. The game plan has continued and will continue because what's the consequence? And if they think I'm going to go away, they obviously haven't looked at my record. Now, mind you, this is San Francisco, a major metropolitan city, the 14th largest city in the count country. I'll go outside, madam. I'm not trying to disrupt you. So, like I said, this is, you know, the 14th largest city in the country and it's oh, 11 10 and there's nobody here who can do what's necessary I can't hear my phone call I need to do a job so I'm going to close the door 
That's quite all right. Anything but being helped. Anything but being helped at the San Francisco Police Department. You know, I'm simply speaking, you know, in a closed environment to my camera. And unfortunately, the acoustics in here carry. That's not my problem. You know, it's interesting. Had they given me any type of satisfaction, correct performance, you know, this wouldn't be going on. But, you know, in a rigged methodology, which is what I continue to tell you, the methodology is rigged, unaccountable, and inhumane. You know, there is no problem. Now, mind you, this is the legal division for the court liaison. You know, this is the place it's supposed to not only, you know, know what the law is, but, you know, perform by it. So far, I've not received either. You know, I, I've not received a timely response to my immediate disclosure request. I've not received the policies, you know, and I've not received the videotapes. Hmm. Why is that? Hmm, it's very interesting. You know, why is that? Mind you, if you go to my own private Guantanamo, you will see that this is the risk management that's dispensed by the city consistently. There you'll see a signed confession. It took seven years. And if they think that I'm not going to stick around to do the correct thing when I'm already exhibited doing the correct thing in an incorrect society that's not accountable, they obviously don't know me. You know, it's like I've said a million times in all the different agencies that I've been to and all the gameplay and everything that you've seen on YouTube, it's all a farce. It's all a lie. Hi. So... Ah, oh, the unfortunate part is, you know, the reality is still being spun with no accountability, you know, for the bankers, for the failed website, for, you know, health care, uh, for the deceit and the dissemination of untruths. You know, this is the country that you get. You know, this is, you know, truth and justice in the American way. Once again, another pipe dream, you know. Yes, 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 yes. The illusion continues. So does the inhumanity. Now, mind you, like I said, San Francisco, 14th largest city in the country. Uh, major metropolitan. Um, I, would, I would hate to guess how much we spend, you know, in our taxes for police services every year and look at the runaround. Look at the inhumanity and the maltreatment which, with which I'm being given. You know, and it stems from the very top. Go back and look at the chief of police videos. Look at the police commission's videos. Look at my supervisor, Jane Kim's videos, you know, in order to try to fix everything and hold them accountable. <laughs> uh, you know, I just don't know more how much hogwash I can swallow. You know, the tribe has been consistent. That is the pattern, folks. That is the risk management. That is the inhumanity. And as you've seen, what's the consequence been? I've been continually following up. Have you seen any follow-up on their part for me? No, only when I continue to follow up. Yes, the rigged methodology of risk management. So let me go back in and sit down for five minutes to continue to show that they don't know anything. Uh, in the meantime, can you please connect me with your LGBT liaison for, you know, this being a, a safe zone? This is not a safe zone, like the police departments? I closed the door because I could not hear the phone calls. That's not my question, madam, and it's not my implication. It's a safe zone. Why wouldn't it be a safe zone? I'm sorry, madam. I'm asking for my rights under, you know, the LGBT liaison. Okay, well, if you sit down, I'll get it for you. Thank you.
Oh, here's something that's interesting. Let's see if any of these things apply. Here is the, the, the spiel. The, the, the statement of purpose for the San Francisco Police Department, which of course does not fulfill its purpose. Or the statement of values, which of course they don't. Uh, we, the members of the San Francisco Police Department, working in partnership with the community, <coughs> are committed to excellence <coughs> in law enforcement and dedicated to the people, traditions, and diversity of our city. <coughs> in order to protect life and property, prevent crime, and reduce the fear of crime, we will provide services and understand the response with compassion, performance, and integrity, and law enforcement with vision. It's been so obvious the vision they've had about providing the compassion, the performance with integrity when it's come to sending me incorrect things and being held accountable. Oh, the lies, the propaganda just continue. All right, next paragraph. Statement of values. The following values guide our members in executing their public duties. They constitute our fundamental beliefs which provide the basis for setting standards. Standards? <laughs> they can't even get me the policies. <laughs> standards? <laughs> and establishing policy. <laughs> uh, delivering services and implement implementing programs. Uh, okay, so one of the things that's, uh, I guess, bullet bulleted here is our our highest priority is the protection of human life. <laughs> we believe that while crime prevention is our principal goal, we should vigorously pursue those who commit serious crimes. Oh, you mean like being lied to for an IDR and not being accountable? That's not a serious crime. Maltreatment and, you know, unclean hands and bad faith is not a serious crime. Well, I guess you'd have to get the DA or maybe the city attorney to prosecute. Oh, what a rigged game. We treat members of the public with respect and dignity. You've seen how much respect and dignity I've gotten. I haven't even gotten my questions answered correctly because, you know, What's the consequence? We maintain the highest level of integrity and professionalism in all actions. <laughs> I believe that the paperwork in the videos disproves all of that. We recognize that the department members are its greatest asset <laughs> and assume a responsibility to treat the 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 something professionally and support their professional de development. Another bullet. We are committed to solving neighborhood problems. <coughs> yeah, right. We care about the quality of life in the city's neighborhoods and believe that our services must answer their needs. <sighs> the illusion continues, folks. We maintain open communications with all communities we serve. Oh yes, open communications. That's why Marine won't see me. That's why I can't get the appropriate answers. That's why the chief of police won't take complaints because they maintain open communications. Oh, it's a lovely lie. We serve their input helps to determine police policy input. I can't even complain and get proper process. What input? Oh, isn't it beautiful when it's a lie? Priorities and strategies. Next bullet. We believe that policing strategies must preserve and advance democratic values. Excuse me. This is a fascist totalitarian system. This is not democratic. There is no transparency. There is no accountability. There is only uh, subterfuge, you know, incorrect process, rig methodology. Oh, and the last one. We are committed to managing our resources in an effect, efficient and effective manner. Hmm. It's a beautiful creed, which means absolutely nothing because none of it is true. And I believe the videos show that. Uh, I think we're approaching 15 minutes of being, you know, way late here. Let me ask about the G LGBT liaison. Yeah, but um, can you please not stand there? You're disrupting our business. How am I disrupting your business? Is there anyone else here, madam? I we love the spin. Calls. Is there anyone we else here? My phone calls. I left. Now, is the LGBT liaison no, coming? Right there. Pardon me? Pardon me? I don't know what you mean by LGBT liaison. Thank you. Very broad term. That's enough. You need to explain more to me. You need to uh, I need to explain more to you. Yeah. There is a big sign in every police station that says LGBT. You know, liaison, safe okay, zone. Sir, you need to be more uh, I don't know what you mean by LGBT 
Yeah. That's all right, madam. This will go on YouTube just to show the professional training, the lack of help and everything else. And I will, I have been specific. Thank you for your spin. I'll be back every day if I have to, to continue to prove the rig methodology. Yes, folks. I believe if you looked at the video on the Northern Station, you saw the little poster in the window about the LGBT liaison. Why don't they want to provide it? Oh, it's quite simple. I'm dead right. The usual. Just like I've been all along. But what's the consequence in this world? Oh, well. Continue to watch the videos. Continue to learn the games. Continue to learn that they don't care and aren't accountable. And continue to learn that I will continue because, you know, what is the alternative? To allow it to continue to harm others as everyone else does? <laughs> Certainly not I.